<laughs> oh, now I did a three, two, I, yeah, one. Yeah, like, I, I, fuck you, Brandon. All right. <laughs> Hold on, it's three, two, one. Look, <laughs> look, we don't have to do the whole clap sync right now, okay? that That's the part that I'm actually really, shut up. <laughs> Can we do it again? I missed it. I'm... You always miss it. Oh my gosh! <laughs> that is. I'm gonna crack one true. open for the boys. Count, <laughs> count of count of three. One, two, five. No! <laughs> <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> the curse of counting. The curse of counting. The curse God of counting. It, Mason. <laughs> uh, I believe the curse of counting is what uh, the count is on Sesame Street. Street. <laughs> He's got the curse of counting. I was he about does. to say. Yeah. Okay. It turns you into the lamest vampire ever and you have to count everything. <laughs> count everything. I mean, that's we, you, well, you know Mason, that's actually some of the lore in a, in in various cultures is uh vampires have like an obsessive need to do a certain task like counting. That's Chinese why one the banged vampire got that. <laughs> yeah, Is that it, not it, true for fairies too, or some? Some they count like rice. Yeah, yeah. It's like if what? if I remember, I can't remember. Why do I know this? I weren't we gonna work <laughs> on something monster oriented or something like that? But I remember looking this up, all this stuff up for for something crack brain related. But yeah, like that's how I know the whole uh, the the one fanged um, Chinese vampires like they love counting and they'll count bags of rice. So like if you're running and whatnot and you all of a sudden like throw it back, that's right. We were going to go and do it. We were going to do this. And it was like they're one throw a bag of rice. Yeah, it's like they've got like one fang and like their whole thing is like they'll chase after you and they'll never stop. And it's almost impossible to like to to get away from them. But if you have anything like a bag of rice or coins, you can throw them down, and then they like feel the compulsive need to count them. So I remember uh, like thinking that we were going to do a couple of different uh, videos and stuff like that. One of like this badass uh, badass parkour vampire that was going to sit there and go, and then all of a sudden like a bag of rice would spill, and the entire time like it would sit there and be like. No. Oh. <gasps> and then start like counting the rice and whatnot, no. and then just look over and they do like, once I get done with this bag of rice, you're dead. I swear to God, I'm gonna, no. I'm gonna yes. munch on you so hard. And then all of a sudden, like the po- like we end it there, and then like a post credit scene would be like that vampire getting ready to pick up the last piece, and then like the person that was being chased being sitting over in a chair and just pushing over another bag of rice. No, <laughs> this this like, is <laughs> this is like a, a Sesame Street episode. We've already yeah. got the count. It, yeah, we've got the count. But like I said, it, there, there were a couple other. Like, now that I'm remembering all this, I'm now reinvigorated to make these shorts. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, oh. three, five, six, seven. Dang it! <laughs> yeah, it. No, it's, it's just over. One, two, three, four. <laughs> you motherfucker! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh. As Lego set as the, as the vampires sit in there counting each grain of rice, you know, like one, two, three, you know, you're off in the corner, like 14, 79, 68, and 93. <laughs> Just no, to fuck with knowing, them. knowing me, I'd sit there and be like, does it matter if it's long grain or short grain rice? Can I throw in wild rice to spice things up? Oh, oh. Just throw like one at a time. Not even like a bag. Just like one and just keep on doing that. You gotta pre-wash your rice too. This is a spicy counting recipe. 100%. Look, Brandon, I want to make counting recipes. I, I do wash my rice. I've washed it for years, but then as like the advent of more TikTok videos have made it apparent, like now I, I go through multiple washes. I even made rice tonight. All right. Now Frickin- was it wild rice to make it more spicy? Uh, jasmine rice with a little bit of chicken bouillon and it- I'm not going through this. All right, I get accused <laughs> of being a, a little bit. Husband playing <laughs> <the ball. laughs> at home. Yeah, 
I spe- what? I specifically asked, like, <laughs> hey, let's record at 7.30 just so that way I could eat all of my dinner and yeah, not you, be told, like, food teas, all right? You, you totally ate Jasmine all up. What? Yes, please. Yes, please. <laughs> I, um... Mason, Mason is confused. Mason we'll, is confused. We'll let it be. Be Why confused, are we talking Mason. about Aladdin? Don't ask. Don't don't Google it. Don't, just don't just ask don't your parents. It, uh-uh. Okay. Well, or, we've we, we've been talking for a while. We've already started this episode. Thank you guys for for tuning into what I will say is actually episode one ninety nine. Uh, the the lost episode I might edit in the future, but for right now we're just doing this. Uh, I am your host Stefan. Joining me today. Uh, we'll, we'll go with oldest first, uh, well, oldest after me. Okay. So, uh, wait, wait, you can shut up. I need to... after you. So you're going to the no, youngest. I are no oldest after me because I already just introduced myself. You're at the bottom 50% of the age group here. I don't care what <laughs> I just so said. The is... oldest after you would be the youngest. This motherfucker over here is Brandon. All right. <laughs> I'm like two spots away from you. I can't be after or before you. It doesn't matter. All right. Look, we're recording. People don't know. I'm getting visibly frustrated. Age all before right? beauty. That's what I you, say. Fine. Go ahead. Age age it all up. All right. You ugly motherfucker. After Brandon. <laughs> Seven months after Brandon. Exactly. Oh no, 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 no! Don't give him an extra month. <laughs> He's yes, six months. We that extra month. <laughs> He's, He's, He's wringing his hands like like a like a villain, and at the same time, does not irritate me nearly as much as the oldest member of our goddamn group. His name is Tyler. <laughs> You're just mad because I'm right. You're stepping all over his uh, his <laughs> intro. You shut the fuck up. You <laughs> gotta speak up. Speak you... up. <laughs> Help it. Right, and then we're we're going down in order. Okay, so now the youngest one of our group. All right, our our cinnabon, our cinnamon roll vampire. We are we have Mason. Hello, hello, <laughs> friends. <laughs> See, he okay. spoke up. Look, do, I, I, don't you start. Don't you start. <laughs> don't you finish. I God. He's, uh, he's well, just happy I mean, to make noises. Very true. Oh. Very Jasmine true. was making noises late, earlier. Should I? Do I need to call Carly? <laughs> <laughs> no, she's in the bath right now. Yeah. These are things you could have said anything else, like una- <laughs> unavailable. Did not not no, around just... to talk. You had to sit there and give specifics. All right. It's I like when the to... I think going to specifics. I just said she's in the bath. Yeah, that's specifics. <laughs> that's a specific location. No, you didn't this even say bathroom. she was in the bathroom. That would have been just slightly, like slightly less. Okay. <laughs> well, she's not making a stinky, so she's in the bath. You're not. You're not helping. Me. <laughs> I swear to God, you're yeah, not helping. She's I, taking a bath before she goes and picks up Candace from work. I well, that's nice. Sincerely hope that she listens to this just enough to make to like to get pissed off at you. I hope you get she hit. I hope you get hit. <laughs> <laughs> no, because it doesn't matter. Because her birthday's coming up, and I've got stuff for her, and she won't hit me. Brandon, that you remind me. Of like the kid who tell or the parent who tells their kid just say that we're unavailable if someone comes to the door, and then a salesman comes to the door and you're like, she's in the bath. My mom's in the bath. <laughs> no, they told tell, me to say tell that. Them, tell them they're, they're, they're tell them we're unavailable. Well, not they didn't say unavailable. Just say they're in the bathroom. And so when I <laughs> knock on people's doors and the kids are like, oh, they're not here. Like that sends up red flags to me. I'm like, you're not supposed to be telling some stranger that. <laughs> Like some six-year-old girl. I could overpower a six-year-old girl and take it whatever I wanted in the house. Not well, making the same metaphor for yourself. Like taken out of context. 100%. 100%. And I got a new ringtone. 
I, I can overpower a six-year-old girl. You just made it. You need to stop saying this. <laughs> yeah, self-incriminating evidence for when I run for governor. Yeah. I, Brandon, I swear to God, if you actually ever do run for any kind of public office, I'm moving across like to 180 degrees the other side of the planet. All right. I don't care. I don't care if it's just you're trying to be a leader of the PTA. I'm done. I'm just, I'm 100% done. I'm gone. I'm not going to because politics is way too corrupt and I would have the nerve to kill everyone else in office. <laughs> so another soundbite you're just <laughs> it's true just they don't deserve to be in today, office like i want to bring the get damn guillotine to the hill and <laughs> stop or start chopping heads off because they are ruining my life so there's Brandon, easier ways brandon's what, just what going to his 22 regression. yeah but a guillotine sends a message mason yeah, <laughs> yeah. you ever heard of the french I have. No. Are you gonna Viva La Re- La La spears too? What? You no, gonna free. spear their heads too? No, Britney was free today. Hashtag Who? free Britney. Where did you just go? <laughs> spear. You know the thing. What I used to say back in the nineties was like we didn't say Britney Spears. We said spear Britney. And he. Why would you do that? She why did Mace, you, why did Mason, you ever say that? Because, because we're the friends 90s. Friends were all horn dogs. Actually, I got it from a girl, okay? <laughs> G- look, lesbian women, horn dogs. Women can be horn dogs too, man. It doesn't matter, all right? They, they can be straight. I'm telling you right now, they'll take down the dick like you ain't never seen before. You need to stop. <laughs> <laughs> well, you just said they'll take that dick like I've never seen before. I'm just saying. <laughs> that poor Richard. I don't that know. I've person. seen a lot of porn and a lot of hentai. <laughs> Neat. So this is 12 minutes of my life. <laughs> yeah, at least you went 12 minutes into tentacle porn. I I didn't bring that up. That was not what happened. <laughs> but you just confessed. Nope, nope, I was Mason about to say. That was, that was what I heard. That was incorrect, my Mason, friend. Mason, from from the my recollection, was the one that said, I love tentacle porn. That was incorrect. <laughs> Mason, I'm going to tell you right now, whether it's correct or incorrect, you just own it. You just sit there and go like, and? All right. If you, if you go and you pass it off as completely normal to you and just go like, I don't, I don't care. It is what it is. Yeah, Every, you just like, look- it gets it, All the wind gets taken out of people's sails. But as soon as you start being shy or Mason about it, all right, it, it, it's, it's ammo. All right. It's like, ooh, we can stoke this fire. All right. Just, next time, just own it. Even if you don't watch it, just sit there and be like, and? Okay, look, there's a difference between squid tentacle and a doggone uh, octopus tentacle. I'll sit there and have it all day long. I don't give a damn. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Cuttlefish. Let's go. <laughs> yeah. We get cuddles that's, afterwards. That's an interesting choice, but you know what? Whatever. <laughs> I'm here for it. <laughs> is that what the cuddle part of the fish is for? You know what, Mason? You yeah. just made what I said a little bit worse, and I'm here for it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Oh, well, oh, is this what you call hearing the Britney? Is when we're doing this. Britney's free, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> why? Why is it that when Brandon is on the, the, the podcast, specifically, specifically, <laughs> I get more frustrated? <laughs> <laughs> It's, well, because you know I'm right. You, mm. mm-hmm. he's like Stefan Kryptonite. This is mm-hmm. indeed a disturbing universe. I, I swear to, like, here, here's the bad thing. Like, I, okay, I want everyone to know. Like, yes, I'm having fun. I actually love the man that's that's over on the middle of my screen called Brandon. But at the same time, I would love to go and drop kick him directly in the face. All right. My toes directly in his nostril cavities would be an amazing thing, in my opinion. In my opinion. Okay. So it's something where when I say I love him, I mean it. When I say I hate him, I'm fucking mean it. All right. <laughs> I hate to break it to you, 
I do not have a foot fetish. I don't care if you have a foot fetish. You're, ha- you're going to develop Look, one once he's done with you. I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to sit there and tickle your tonsils with my big toe. I don't give a damn. All right. It's just, it's going to happen. And there's the name of the podcast episode. <laughs> <laughs> my tonsils were removed. Yeah. He's just saying oh, that. He doesn't you actually are. mean it. Right. Oh, better be careful tickling that. Bad things could happen. We, well, or good things. It just depends on your perspective. All right. So, <laughs> it's, it's been a week. I'll just blanket say it. How have y'all been? Anything new? Brandon, you can shut up real quick. Anything new <laughs> I'm with not everyone saying else? anything. <laughs> God, I'm tired. <laughs> I take it that now okay now is that tired of us or just tired in general like long day you're just tired uh in general I'm just tired <laughs> uh, look it's Friday all right we get <laughs> you ain't got no <laughs> what god damn it, what is it you ain't got no job you ain't got shit to do <laughs> <laughs> I'm missing a couple from? of lines. It's from the movie Friday. Uh, oh. <laughs> uh, I've been spending my days watching mostly Steinfeld and Aqua Teen Hunger Force. That's been my life. Very weird combo, but... Eh. But it's not. That's the thing, is it's <laughs> not a weird combo. I get it. One and of I these won't... times... Sorry, go ahead. Go ahead. I was just going to say, one of these times I want to start up and be like, and I've decided that you're pissing me off. (laughs) (laughs) Wouldn't Aqua Teen Hunger Force be a combo? You've got your meat, you got your shake, and you got your fry. And you got your toy inside, which is Carl. Mm, I'm not touching that. I'm just going to take it because it's uh, my cord anyway. Alcohol. To touch that <laughs> with a ninety foot pole. I Are see you a podcast. Is is <laughs> Stefan crying? <laughs> you've you've totally not missed this, have you? I think the audience has totally not missed this. <laughs> here's the, here's the thing. I know that the audience <laughs> has missed it. All right, because. For some stupid, strange reason that I understand yet still hate. Anytime you're on the podcast, our numbers do better. All right. You want to know why? Because Brandon hashtag is trending lately. We're not going to go into it. I'm not saying Mm, it. I hate it. it. It's like uh, my name is now being drugged through the uh, drug through the mud. Why? What's happening? Just we won't talk about it on the podcast. It's political bullshit, Mason. Oh, so it's a different Brandon? Hold up. Hold up. Mason, before Hi. we let this go, what do you think it is? And I, all I'm going to say is I'll say the phrase, okay? It's let's go, Brandon. Okay? Mason, what do you think What What do you think the current meaning of that is right now? Uh... People trying to get Brandon to drink again. I mean, I've got no idea. I haven't heard almost. that. <laughs> <laughs> I I haven't heard that saying. I don't know at all what you're talking about. Okay, uh, okay. you're lucky. Yeah. Look, is it I, is it the person who emailed you with the fan art, and they really like how it's Brandon, no, so they're emailing no, you to have him more no. on? No. No, they've got a name I can't even pronounce. All right, but we'll get into that possibly later. No, like and, I said. And on the continuation of my name, I was at Kiva Juice, and they had a poster from one of the local gyms, and they were having a kyle that's going to be going. So, so what is a kyle Is that like – I don't comp- know. Is that like a competition to see who can chug a Monster Energy drink and then punch through three drywall walls the fastest, or what? 
while while it slinging out be. racial insecurities without really meaning to and yeah. then backing up with what 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 i'm just saying <laughs> i don't so know is a kyle kind of like a karen uh it mm. i just learned i just learned the karen term like two days ago uh, what i mason <laughs> what how did you uh, even done you... with this yet and you're <laughs> trying to come at us with that bullshit how I, uh, did you it's... just become aware of karens I, I i still don't get it is it just is that just like another word for the b word or is that something different well, Kind of, but you work in retail. You should know all about the Karens. But here's the thing. I bet I bet you a Karen has entered his presence and started losing it on him, and he just went like, Oh, you seem slightly irate today. Let me see if I can help you further. All right, he, he, he just, like, 100%. I, I don't know. I, I, I just help people, and... People try okay, to tip like, me, and I'm not allowed to accept tips, so I tell them I can't, and but like, I move honestly, on. Honestly, sometimes that's the best way to deal with a Karen, is just be overly nice to them. I'm just overly nice to everyone. <laughs> so you know that you're being overly nice. I, most of the time. Yeah, well. I, I, I don't know. So wait, bad. it is kind of like a Karen. It's like a male. A Kyle is a male Karen. Is that what no, I'm understanding? No, Kyle no, no. is like a. It's it's the same in the punk. sense that it has the uh, it has a stereotype that goes along with it, but it's not the same in the sense that a Kyle is a male Karen. But here's gotcha. the thing. Here's the thing is is that of the of the dynamic gender roles like karen is primarily female kyle is male males also have another one which is chad and you oh slightly different but still just as just as annoying and obnoxious do i need to get the whiteboard yeah right notes i'll tell you later (laughs) We'll, we'll get mason with the whiteboard and he'll be back here like it's all connected (laughs) <laughs> you, fuck you. <laughs> I should do that. It's all connected. We, we see it go from I here. Swear to, you there. did that on purpose. You <laughs> did that on purpose. <laughs> we dropped a Brandon reference. It wasn't in the last episode, and I was so happy. I like I was I was conscious of it the entire time. I was sitting there just going like no one's dropping it. This is awesome. It's amazing. And straight up, what 23 minutes in, you had to sit there and hit us with that bullshit. All right, you're gone. <laughs> so it is all connected, is what you're saying. Shut I'll see you when I'm welcome back into the podcast again. <laughs> <laughs> we only get Candace once a year. We only get Tyler once a year, but two different reasons, weirdly enough. <laughs> I thought I was going to wait to say it a little bit longer into this podcast. I hate you all. God damn it. It's why can't Mm-mm. you know what? I'm. Say it, say it. <laughs> Why can't we be normal? Stuff fun, stuff fun, stuff fun. Why can't I go an episode with, with, I'll say mainly just Brandon, but especially this quartet, all right? Why does this quartet annoy me the most out of everybody? <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm going to say it's the Brandon energy. We just kind of well, feed off him and then throw it back I out. Think- Think about what kind of bad energy, too, will come off if Carly was on, too. She would be trying to do her puns the whole time. It's it's because uh, Brandon is also a Kyle, so. But but here's here's the thing is, like, would Carly actually, would she entertain all this? I don't think so. I don't think so. Look, she, I'm pretty confident, Brandon, she would have told you to shut up, too. No, she would have gone on rants about Kyle's. 
Very true. And Karen's. 100%. And then stories about Brandon's that people are saying. That's a possibility. I don't know. Oh, there's a third one? You... <laughs> what third one? <laughs> now Mason's is... getting confused. Like, there's too many names. I can't remember them all. <laughs> what? You said there's a Brandon too, right? That's how it all started. <laughs> Next thing you know, there's going to be a Brandon 3. We call that the Wait, third. How many girls are there, too? Is there just Karen, or do they have different Yeah, classes? Carly's a name. Uh, Ray's a name. Candace is a name. I'm pretty what? sure your mother I, has a name. Uh, Brandon's I think just he's making referring shit up. to, like, the, the stereotype name. Oh, stereotypes. So, uh, so, so there's, uh, there's the thing, Mason, is uh, yes. you have your Karens, and then you have your Sharon. And your Sharon is the uh, the leader of the Homeowners Association. And that's all you need to know. Okay. <laughs> 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 like, best, best lawn awarder? Stuff. Yeah, yeah, that's totally it. They they only really give the trophies out to the losers, though. <laughs> just on Mason, go on TikTok and just type in "get fucked," Karen. Don't don't do that. Don't do that, Mason. <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> I'm just I'm just saying, like it it deals nothing with being a cinnamon roll or innocent or anything. I'm just gonna say it right now. Just don't do it. Just don't do it. Not worth it. <laughs> I'll send you the links. You shouldn't. Don't click them. <laughs> treat I mean, them like TikTok, treat though. them like they're phishing yeah. scams. Yeah, well, who's been sending TikToks lately? Is, is it Stefan that's been Shut sending the, the TikTok up. links lately? <laughs> yeah, you sent that food tease one. Yeah, uh, I can. <laughs> I've sent a few. <laughs> Here's the thing, though. I, I'm more known for sending them, like, to like individually, I will send stuff out. And I am very particular on who I send each TikTok to, okay? I, it's like I'm going for maximum amount of giggles when I send this out. So. That's a good cause. That's a good world peace cause right there. How uh, many giggles yeah. can I get out per vid? I don't know. How, Tyler, are you to the giggles yet? No. Down to here. <laughs> <laughs> and we haven't gotten any giggles yet? <clears throat> I no, think you got yet. a bad batch. We've got the chuckle. All right, just not a giggle. Yeah. There you go. How many well, chuckles I'll... could a Tyler chuckle of a giggle could chuckle a chuckle? You need to stop. That just sounded like your brain was trying to give up and you just tried to keep soldiering on. All right. That's, when you hit the first speed bump, just let it go. Just stop. When you try to Is that push what you do when you're driving? <laughs> was Brandon talking? I, I really, I honestly stopped listening for a second. <laughs> no, I'm not talking. Personally, I've put him on mute this entire time. I haven't heard a single word he said. There we go. See? Uh, <laughs> I kid. I hate your friendship. I don't know if I can mute him at this point. Uh, I wonder. <laughs> you See, do I do mute my own microphone, so if like, well, I'm getting off, I, so I do it. While but... Can I? Did that actually? <laughs> yes, yes, it works. I don't hear shit from him. <laughs> 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 Yay! <laughs> oh, 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 oh shit! I don't know if oh. I can turn it back on. <laughs> Brandon, never be a mime. I can only do it myself. Oh, there you are. <laughs> we missed you, Brandon. How have you been? You didn't miss me one day. I heard you all <laughs> laughing at me. Well, I still missed you. <laughs> Aim's getting better. <laughs> Not if you're a stormtrooper. <laughs> yeah, right there. Do you need to go change your underpants? I found a new toy. Fawn's <laughs> wet already. Is a bad thing? <laughs> for you guys, it means nothing. For Brandon, you are fucked. <laughs> you do know I can just reverse it. 
<laughs> the reverse card that you played me, I can play it back. So, uh, I swear to so, God, with the times plus, two, plus two, plus it, two to that. <laughs> oh man, I that I'm now about to have way too much fun. This is bad. <laughs> oh, there we It'll go. Get old real quick. Well, I hope it screws up your audio for editing. And probably not. <laughs> so. There we go. Well, today today was a bit of a day for for some of us, including like you know stuff that we watched. Brandon, you've got some shit you want to talk about. God damn, my eyes burn. <laughs> uh, don't don't get what is it you're drinking there? Some sort of rum. Don't get that in your eyes. Rum it's and stuff. fresh cranberry juice. But I have a feeling what's making my eyes burn is part of what was going on with my dinner. We're not going to talk about that. Brandon, carry on. Jasmine. <laughs> Did Jasmine have a little something there? You should probably go get that. Jasmine jacket. have a lot of something. No, there. it was Bank Disney long. Plus. It was Disney Plus Day today, and everyone, including me, was excited about the Star Wars um, news. And they released a Boba Fett like kind of documentary. That was like a twenty minute episode. It was really cool, but they were supposed to do something huge, and they didn't freaking do it. Okay, There's so almost... what? So, like, what the fuck is Disney Plus Day? Is is it like Amazon Prime Day where you get to watch whatever the fuck you want? You know, because everyone has Amazon Prime that day, or like, what? What is this? It's the anniversary when Disney Plus launched, but they give like all these trailers and things that are coming up in the next year. Oh, so it's just so they talk about like their big it's just things Disney that are bullshit. happening. Yeah, of course. Um, but they were supposed to do the Kenobi trailer. But all they did was a stupid teaser, like, behind-the-scenes thing that they didn't, released, like, two days ago. Didn't... I thought they, uh... I thought they stopped the Kenobi movie. No, because... they, they went and done. It's all filmed and everything. <clears throat> and it was bullshit. They were supposed to do something, but... And there was, like, no Star Wars news. Um, so something must, must have happened behind the scenes for them to just pull the plug, but we did get, uh, a She-Hulk teaser, which was pretty cool. And cause that's been talked about for a couple years. And then, uh, a Moon Knight teaser too. If you guys know Moon Knight. So uh, I do. Oscar do. Isaac up. is, is being the actor. Fuck so that's going to be Mark a blockbuster. Spectre. This is for you, Konshu. God damn, dude, Tyler, you know, you know Moon Knight. We should have been talking way like a lot, a lot, a lot longer ago about this. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, Moon Knight. It looks that was probably the best thing was Moon Knight, and then they they had various things. There's going to be a new Predator movie, um, a big hero. Wait, Six Disney series. Does Predator? They bought Fox. I remember. Mm. Oh. Fox. So, uh, a new Predator from, from called my Prey. Is they didn't get, like all of Fox, but they did get Correct. a good portion of good like, portion of Fox. It. But yeah, property, like so twenty twenty first studios more specifically. Yeah. So twenty first studios, um, and so they got I think it's called Prey, and then there's a Big Hero Six series coming out. And Never saw the movie. You. <laughs> that Let hurts me, me more so than anything you've so said. Mm. Yeah, I never watched it. Mason, well, you should. Over... Oh, that's what the uh, la 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 la. New new enchanted uh, movie calling Disenchanted. Um, some more Marvel stuff, which I didn't know what half of it is because I'm not a Marvel guy. But I guess their stocks tank today. Oh, they're continuing the X Men series from the 90s see the, the cartoon he, series mm -hmm. yep <clears throat> here's basically what i've gathered from all this is that because because brandon chokes on the dick of warner brothers and dc that anything <laughs> see, that three. disney oh, plus right and marvel here. just had to say was lukewarm at best for him like a, i was all about the star wars 
a step above fresh dog shit. All right. That's about <laughs> that's about where all of this news went from because none of it was what you wanted as far as like the Kenobi trailer. That, that that's they it. They promised were... <laughs> a trailer. See? They... I See? think X-Men is pretty cool. And you believed them? You fool. Well, Bra- I had they were they were tickling the back of my throat. So yeah. Brandon, that would be tantamount if uh if Doggone DC announced that, hey, we're actually gonna make a Green Lantern series. And we're actually gonna uh, show you yeah. we're actually gonna show you that we're making the grand the the Green Lantern series. Not just tell you, we're gonna show you. Okay. And it's actually gonna be good. Not okay, that we're gonna okay. sit here and Gotham the hell out of this. But but I want Ryan Reynolds back as Green Lantern with the uh, CGI suit. I, I will no here here's what I will say. Controversial take. All right. Green Lantern is a fantastic movie when it is not on Earth. All right. Everything that he had to do on Earth can can choke on That's thousands. That's what I think the series is not going to be on grotesque Earth. dicks. It, all right. And it will but not he, be Hal Jordan. It See, okay, here's my problem. What is problem. it going to be? Is it going to be uh, John Stewart? No, yeah. that's my other problem. Okay. Is, was, isn't that's it supposed to be Guy Gardner? Oh. Yeah. I hope Wait. not. I hope that's not. What I, if I'm right, it's Guy Gardner. And I'm sorry, one of, the, one of the most irritating and lamest Green Lanterns that I could ever think of. All right, I realize that some people like him, and he stands for quite a bit over inside, uh, over in, I believe, over inside the LGBTQ community. But I'm sorry, is one of the most boring Green Lanterns. Wait, so there's actually a Green Lantern thing coming out? I thought you were making a joke. Nope, nope. There actually is going to be one. They oh, talked yep, about they it do for have a, a cast for Guy, Guy Gardner. See, that's what I'm saying. Ah. I'm, I am really not excited for it. Why if you make him? It- you could, I'm going to say, Brandon, you know how, you know how doggone, I, we already talked about this. You know, how Green Lantern could be great. Freaking make it lethal weapon. All right. Lethal weapon in space with, with John Stewart and, and, and Hal Jordan. It'd be freaking awesome. Okay. Just the two of them going nuts all over the cosmos and going and basically being just the best of the Lantern core. And still having like good moments. I'm telling you right now, I would watch that every single day. It'd be could amazing. It, could it be John Stewart and Hell Jordan? I thought uh, John Stewart inher- inherited Hell Jordan's ring. Maybe I'm maybe I'm wrong. I'm not the big DC guy, but no, there there's three like three Earth dudes at mm-hmm. once. I, I knew yeah. there were three Earth guys, but but I thought like Hell Jordan died and then. One of the the other guys inherited his ring. So they're actually supposed to be uh, start filming like any moment now. Yeah, it, it's the, yeah. Oh, there there was supposed to be something else that I auditioned for that was supposed to start filming. It still hasn't started filming yet, and I still have not received my not in the cast notice. So I'm still sitting here going like, did I make it? Did I not? This is the problem with DC. Is that you're all like, is this actually greenlit? That's hmm. how it is with one of my jobs I interviewed two weeks ago. He was supposed to get back to me this week, and I've emailed him, and I haven't gotten back. I'm mad. Uh-huh. Was it Never for... seen Lethal Weapon. Mason, huh? that doesn't Where surprise me. Where the fuck did that come from? <laughs> <laughs> came from like 20 minutes ago. I was holding it in for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> do you need another one Tyler do you have another one I mean I have more alcohol but I don't have another one of these well, what's the difference is one stronger than the other yes bring up the strong stuff man because you're gonna need to forget this <laughs> night you say that, I'm just gonna walk over here with that bottle of uh, Ishtabun that Mason brought me from Mexico. Uh oh, you still have that? I do. Yeah, I haven't really. drinking any of it. I am sorry about that. I really <laughs> am. 
I've never been so sorry about anything in my life than giving you guys that. <laughs> no, no, it's fine. Wait a like, second. I'm not going to be second. like, oh, that's awful. But like, Wait a second. I, I just remember, does everyone still have, other than Brandon, does everyone still have their bottle? Yeah. Because I, no. I have not actually tasted it. Uh, so I opened mine so Candace could try it because <laughs> I had to drive her home, so I wasn't going to drink it. Uh, she's She's not impressed. Okay, but Tyler, here's the thing. Have you tried it? No, no, not at all. Tyler, go get your bottle. Oh, oh fuck, okay. Go get your bottle. No. <laughs> all right, bottle. time break. <laughs> Brandon, you and I have got to carry this show for a couple minutes. No, <laughs> you can just cut it and post it and edit. If you look at, you know, there's there's a full-size boobs behind oh. Tyler in his back room. What? Yeah, Where? don't you see it? Don't no. you look. Audience, look. I'm looking. I am looking. I can't I see it. With my eye, something booby. I see a fox. Oh, there's Tyler. Okay. Did you say Tyler's so, foxy? So that is not what I said. Lady. For for the audience, especially the um, <clears throat> the audio audience. Hello, so a little audio. bit of backstory. Um, well, no, better yet, who better to tell it other than the person that got us this? All right. <laughs> So, Mason, if you could share. Uh, I went to Cancun, what was that, earlier this year, I think, or something. <laughs> and uh, I went to go see the the Great Pyramids over there. Um, the, where the, the same place where the movie El Dorado is based off of, The Road to El Dorado by DreamWorks. That movie's based off of where I went. It was Tyler, great. Tyler, wait. It was fun. Tyler, wait. <laughs> <laughs> and uh uh on one of the tours of the the cenotes the rivers of the dead uh uh they had us so give a toast and we did it but i didn't realize it was a shot of like some alcohol it was like this green alcohol and i guess it was made with local honey and i thought it was all right so oh geez i don't know what's going on with me <clears throat> So I got everyone, I got all the CB people, some of this honey liquor, and then it turns out that I bought them all the wrong thing. I bought not what I drank. And I've heard terrible stories about how terrible it is and what kind of person I am because I gave it to them. And um, the bottle I had was a picture of me and my mom on the front of it. So that was neat. Okay. See, and, see, I don't have it anymore. I don't know what happened to it. Heartwarming story, but as, as someone that is that that okay, Tyler, you've already taken the top off of yours. Yes. Okay. I've got my I've got my shot glass ready. Okay. It, do you have liquid in your shot? Yes. Yes. I'm okay. It's, it's I, I'm, I'm ready. I, I'm I'm gonna pour mine. Okay. Pour and pour, before pour, oh, fuck pour. that was too much. <laughs> <laughs> that was more than a shot. That's how I call it. One for me and one for oh. my boys. Okay, so before we do the first, we have to we have got to describe this smell. Okay, so here, well, I'll go. You've got to open your mouth and have your oh. tongue down, and then to give it a smell. Okay, so for those for those that drink, this smells exactly like Jaeger. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, I want. You, no, you don't. I liked it. It's, it smells like Jaeger, but where Jaeger still has that like, <laughs> the like weird sweetness that hits back over here. I don't get the sweetness. I get chemical, which is also part of Jaeger. But still, d don't you take a sip at all. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm smelling. Okay. Oh God! This Tyler, what do you so, smell? So I am, I am getting like hints of honey smell, but like, yeah, it's it's not, it's not like an overpowering. It's it's not like meat. It's not a honey drink. Yeah, no. it was advertised as a honey drink when I bought it, but it was also Mexico. So I, I'm I I'm know. going to tell you guys right now. This smells like I'm calling out of work tomorrow. Sick. All right. Are you calling out of work tomorrow sick? 
I I don't want to. Uh, we'll, we'll we'll find out tomorrow. Now, won't yeah. We're gonna find no, out. Like, he won't tell us. He'll be in shame, and no, you, we'll all be you, disappointed. Everyone will know in about two hours when I'm dry heaving over, like over in the toilet, going like this was a mistake. All right. Or you could go to work and give some to Glenn. Glenn won't be at work tomorrow, and Glenn doesn't drink. <laughs> so. He already called out. See. No. It, it, <laughs> it, anyway. So all right, Tyler, you ready? I'm ready when you are. I'm sorry. Here we so go. So sorry. Bottoms Tyler, up. con pie. <laughs> that was not as bad as I was thinking it was going to be. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Tyler. <laughs> yeah, it tastes like cough syrup. Yeah. <laughs> That's what Pepsi Blue used to be like. Like... I'm not gonna lie. I can it, taste. It might, it might help that I've already had my one can of of beer, but like, I don't think I'd want to. I don't think I'd want that to be my first drink of the night. No. No. Here's so what a... you're saying is that you will drink it if you're desperate. Yes, because I like. I can taste. I can actually taste the honey. Like I can taste the honey, and I can taste. The black licorice. And that's... Something's weird happening to my stomach right now. <laughs> <laughs> what, you, you, what happened? Do you have a garbage can nearby? It's almost like invaders... Like, invaders of this drink <laughs> came downstairs and found a multitude of rum. And they're now just... Bou- like, they're just bouncers over at the door trying to get in. And the rum isn't having it. <laughs> are they being a karen i have no idea but i'm gonna tell you right now they're getting into this club i can already feel it like it, this is a so, losing battle <laughs> so um this 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 brings up a thought uh you know how um we've we've played pirates right uh sea, sea of, of thieves. thieves several times mm-hmm. uh and in that game you you drink grog right yeah. Yeah. Uh I got a little curious as to what grog is and looked it up. It is basically watered down rum with lime juice added. Oh. So imagine how that tastes. I don't have to imagine because this is going to happen. <laughs> I want some. This is going to happen right now. So all right, there we this, go. We're going to find this, out what grog tastes like. So well, did Stefan just have fruit and honey? Is that what I'm hearing? Alcohol, fruit, and honey? Uh, I mean, I guess that's kind of <laughs> what your Ishtaboon is. What proof what, is What it? is schnapps? Uh, oh. This is 30% alcohol, so it would be 60 proof. Yeah. Uh, oh. Schnapps is a drink. <laughs> is it I mean, Russian? It, schnapps is an alcoholic beverage is, that is usually flavored like several things. It's they uh, might be flavored like candy. Peppermint schnapps during the holidays. Oh. <laughs> oh, there he is. He's got oh, his uh, barrel mug. Now, is that, lemon juice or is, that, is that lemon juice or lime juice? So. <clears throat> We've got either, lime either juice. Works. Like like when when I did look up uh, what grog was, it just says it's either lemon or lime juice. Okay, just... what percentage? Bacardi. And we got Bacardi because that's freaking awesome. That stuff is rum. I thought it was vodka. Great god uh, damn! Bacardi makes several drinks. One yep. of them being rum. Mm. Okay, so I've already got a li- like we said water down. I put a little bit of water, like a splash of water, in here. Okay. Okay, I wouldn't consider that watered down a splash. You go shut up. I what? I was a little concerned there when you started tipping that bottle up all the way. <laughs> I was like, how much are you putting in there? How much? <laughs> but no, Not you didn't much. you didn't have much in it, so uh uh-uh. uh. You did yeah. that earlier. Okay, and then <laughs> let let's see. 
I, I, okay, this, there's going to be a delayed effect, but y'all tell me when to stop with the lime juice. Squeeze it harder, I Daddy. That's good. Right there. Okay. Wow. Is there more? I don't drink, more so don't ask me. Or more lime? I don't know. Probably more lime, right? I would assume. Okay, taste the finger. The hell taste no. Taste the finger. I want my taste first it. taste to be the. Oh. <laughs> Our reaction was already <laughs> worth it. Stefan's calling out <laughs> sick tomorrow. <laughs> you ever, you ever smell something and you, you, you instantly have like, I've made really dumb decisions. <laughs> And here's this, one. This is one <laughs> that has me concerned. <laughs> okay. Here we okay. go. Grog! Three. Go ahead. Drink. Drink. Go drink, 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 drink. Drink the flagon. Drink the flagon. Drink the flagon. All right. All of it. Tyler said. All of it. You go fuck yourself. Oh, my God. Okay. Let me uh, go on my other monitor, and I'll pull something oh. up. What what do you think? Could you live off of that for a sea voyage for seven months? I could. <laughs> you could. If that Me. like if that's grog, a, I can understand how it will mess you up, one hundred percent. I will get that. Two, the lime juice does all of the heavy lifting, like straight up. Like yeah, that might have been a lot of lime juice, but seriously. It did all the heavy lifting over inside that drink. Now, going down, there's no burn or anything like that. But uh, there we go. <clears throat> you can all like I can already I can already feel like I'm telling you right now. If we were playing Sea of Thieves, 100 percent in like 10 <laughs> minutes, the accent is coming in full force. <laughs> <laughs> I, I miss that. We need to play Sea of Thieves again. Come on. Yes, please. Okay. Yes, please. I, now, I, I'm just telling you, the, the the what 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 was our boat? The rust bucket. The the captain of the rust bucket would be here quite quite hastily. <laughs> now we need y'all to be drunk, except me. I'll be the designated driver. Fuck you! <laughs> you're, you're not the navigator. You can barely operate the sails. All right, that is also <laughs> true. That is also true. Put him within thirty feet of the helm. You goddamn right. <laughs> All right, I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to steer the boat. It might end up over inside a monsoon. It might end up on a beach, but I'm telling you right now, we're getting to our destination. Hell or high water. Well, more more hell than anything else, but just saying. <laughs> uh, Tyler, what did you call the drink that I got you? What is the name of that again? Ishtabun. Ishtabun? Yes. I looked up how it's pronounced. Because you brought it. I was like, how the fuck is this pronounced? Because it starts with an X. <laughs> Xanax. And when they sit there and say it's the nectar of the gods. Yeah, that was. Wait, says yeah. That? They used to kill people to get to the gods. Maybe that's what they meant. What? What? Mason, why? Why? <laughs> <laughs> Because according to their mythology, like, like, because there's different that levels. Was a hypothetical at best. <laughs> well, okay, just the short version. You get to skip the entire process of going through heaven. You just go straight to the god. If you die, either sacrificed or in battle. Gotcha. Is what they believed. Gotcha. So the victor would get their head chopped off. I'm I'm gonna become the next Kratos. I don't want to be. If you win, you get your head chopped off. Which had uh, all of it. Well, I'm, just... I'm already circumcised, so the one's already been chopped off. I'm I'm just gonna live over on some other boat in some other island, profess to no deity whatsoever, and just enjoy grog. All right, <laughs> grog. You ain't grow lime trees then. I'm my your ship. I'm not gonna lie. Like this, this is bad. I can see me drinking this on a semi-regular basis. All right? <laughs> like, 
just Y'all... just just need to alter the the levels of rum, water, and lime juice to to be a nice. I think I found it. Different drink. I'm not gonna. At least for me, I think I found it. I'm gonna tell y'all right now, like straight up, there might be a time when y'all like when we do the podcast live, and I, I just straight up make this. All right, you, I I can feel it. (laughs) I can already (laughs) feel. Damn it! It works fast. The wheels are turning. (laughs) (laughs) I like the sound of this frog already. how is the bar doing in the with everything? Is there a Mexican standoff going on? Huh? <laughs> in in your stomach? Bar? Which? Oh, in my the stomach. One in your stomach? Oh, yeah. Yeah. it's weird. The, 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 the grog has already confiscated all of the <laughs> all of the alcohol. I was about to say the grog basically went down and straight up like Pirates of the Caribbean style just went into the <laughs> bar told everyone to shut the fuck up and sit down and like everyone obeyed all right and the grog <laughs> took over so <laughs> it, it's, it's one of those where like my stomach went from being like to like we're good kneel before grog we are so, good this- so what you're saying <laughs> is that if you eat or drink something that's not agreeing with you drink grog and we'll fix it maybe Shit, maybe <laughs> Or Shoot, maybe is or is <laughs> lime juice helps with like motion sickness or uneasy stomachs. I'll tell you right now. <laughs> I'm gonna look at this up. Google, oh, no. you're Woo! my friend. <laughs> <laughs> was was that just straight lime juice? Yeah. <laughs> He didn't even put it in a shot glass. He just dumped the bottle in his mouth. Um, <laughs> lime juice might make you sober than a lot of things right now. It makes you salivate too. Mm. It will uh, oh, improve. Di- lime I'm juice a- will help improve digestion. I mm, I might have. I'm. I, damn. I might have find. I might have found a new drink. <laughs> <laughs> if you, you expel- no, no, that could help. You're calling out tomorrow because this you're going to love this sentence. If you experience constipation, the acidity of limes can clear the excretory system and simulate bowel activity. I'm shitting tonight! <laughs> so, yeah. you wake up in the morning, you got a stomach ache, you go for the Pepto, you throw it away, you drink some grog, and then you drink a bunch of lime juice to sober yourself up, and then you spend half the shift in the bathroom. Here's the thing, I mean, Mason. Could. It's not that the lime is gonna sh- is gonna sober you up. It's basically just gonna clear you out. All right. So I'll be that <laughs> yeah. one dude over inside the bath. Like I'm gonna tell you right now, Chuck is gonna be sitting over at the register tomorrow. Like, oh, can I can I can I help you with with, with your dog? On okay. Here here's the drive shaft. Here's a and all you're gonna hear is just over in the back room, just. Woo! <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, it helps with your stomach tummy aches, and it'll clear you out. Oh God, that's freaking Caribbean be... right up in okay. here. Okay, here's here's how you know how good grog is. I keep on going back for the grog when I've got this right in front of me. Okay, I keep like you. You. It's it's between grog and the and preferred drink right now, and you're you keep going for the grog. Or it's clearing out your kidneys or clearing out your ass. I'm gonna tell you right now, grog is just it's good. It's good. <laughs> What's gonna I, happen when you run out? I'm already I'm already out. Like is, I'm already out. <laughs> The, the the question is the liquor store uh, within walking distance because you're not driving stores. now. Oh, it ain't open now. It it closes at seven, and I don't know if yeah, they're going to be open Utah. tomorrow. Okay, so you could pull a Family Guy and make turn your car into a boat. Here's what I'll tell Go you: around if, blast people with cannons. If you love the podcast, send your send your rum of choice to PO Box eleven seventy eight over in Delta, Utah. <laughs> Zip code eight four six two four. 
Okay, and send that into care of Stefan Watson of Craig. Don't do this. Don't do. Do not send. Do, 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 do not send him rum samplers. Do you can't not. because it w- it would not get through the mail in Utah. One hundred percent. Do not try to send me alcohol. If, yeah. Utah you will not send, allow it. If you like cracked brain content, do not send him alcohol because nothing will get done. <laughs> send him money for alcohol. <laughs> no, oh. the, yeah, money no. can get through the mail. Alcohol cannot. One hundred percent. So, I, I I will say this right now that we are coming up on time for the show. Okay, no. I I really hope y'all have enjoyed this, especially the last twenty <laughs> minutes. <laughs> it went from "I hate you all" to. I love you, man. You I, love that me, word, my brother. I love Grog. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say I love Grog right now. Okay, <laughs> that, that's that that's gonna the, be Stefan's next pet. That's grog. the name of the goddamn episode at this point. I love Grog. All right, <laughs> all right, because yeah, I'm gonna tell you right now what's gonna happen is I'm gonna end this podcast. We're gonna chat for a little bit, and then I'm gonna go make some doggone spicy, uh, spicy chicken bites and what i don't know why i keep on doing this with my do you want spicy <laughs> while your while your system's getting cleared out yeah 100 percent yeah ma- your oh. ass is gonna hurt what what kind of weak no, uh, ass is not, no system I, no. of digestion my, do you have that no you no no a little bit of my spiciness. ass is not going to hurt i, I know uh, you're white but goddamn, Brandon! <laughs> no, I'm saying when you're drinking, you don't do spicy. I do spicy all the time. It does not. I like have, spicy, but it I does don't not do... have certain occasions. Spicy happens at all times. This is what happens when you are ethnically motivated, Brandon. You would know nothing about this, all right? <laughs> when you got a little bit of darkness over inside your soul or inside your pigment, you can handle spice at all times of day and all times of situations i'm gonna tell you right now i've got a little bit of alcohol in my system guess what spicy is hitting my butthole all right so hey <laughs> damn Speaking straight of- it's not spicy if to- you're not shit and fire the next day 100 it, although it won't it goes through your mouth day, first. It's, it's gonna be about 3 a.m at best <laughs> i hope it goes through your mouth first <laughs> It goes in the mouth, but it never touches anything else in between. It goes straight mouth to asshole. All right, <laughs> same hole. Oh god. That, okay, we need to end this. I, I can't talk anymore. The grog is hit. <laughs> Goodbye, grog. I know. Like, like thirty seconds after I took that shot, I was like, "Oh, my lips are numb now." Oh boy, this is a thing. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna tell you right now. Imagine I keep on slinking over in the seat. And it's <laughs> He's gone. I've never seen this side of you guys before. This is fun. I you love you, Mason. Poisoned him, Mason. I love Both you, Mason. of us poisoned them. Uh, okay, <laughs> it's, it's I like drinking cough syrup. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, I, I need to, I need to, I need to focus on en- on ending this. Okay, so, <laughs> so God, he's so. God, he's he's flying away. You guys, this you guys want to record some Sea of Thieves real quick? <laughs> no, we're not recording it. Yeah. Okay, so uh, that was episode the, the true episode one hundred ninety nine of the Correct Brain Podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Come sail away. Come sail away. Come sail, 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 sail away with away. me. Hey guys. Come sail away. Sail away. <laughs> <laughs> if you enjoyed this podcast, please don't send us alcohol. <laughs> send grog. Send grog. Wait, if you have wait, something wait, that wait, needs wait. to be. The last one you you put up on YouTube, right? Because you got the video. Uh-huh. So so now we can do the the hit that like and subscribe and the 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 bell button if you want notifications for more. We need of a this grog button. Bullshit. We need a grog button. <laughs> <laughs>
please chuck that grog button if you liked this. 100% Mason, you you my man. You my man, you know it. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm missing out on a lot of fun. Yeah, I guess. Uh, 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 uh. Like, like I'm I <laughs> I support your decision to not drink, Brandon. But like, <laughs> sometimes there's some fun to be had, <laughs> so I get it. <sighs> I oh. miss the fun. Okay, well, y'all, we this is this has been us over on the podcast. Event uh, apparent, uh, I can't. Apparently, eventually, <laughs> apparently, y'all need to watch Angelana? the video version of the podcast. <laughs> Shut Apparently, up. I'm actually going to get through this. <laughs> I'm trying. The floor is lava. I'm trying. No, it's not. All right. I'm trying. The floor is lava. I'm yeah, trying. Not, so with, not with as much as he's drinking tonight. Nope. I'm going to tell you right now, you'd have a better chance of saying the, the floor was up. All right. So I'm just going to say right now, thank you all for listening to this episode of the Crack Brain Podcast. I love you all so much. These idiots love you, too. We will definitely go. With, we will definitely talk. God, God damn it. Talking to you all later. <laughs> Goodbye, friends. Hit that like and subscribe button. Hit the notification Just bell for a new drink grog. I can't find the cursor. There it Get is. Get uh, Brandon's grog. <laughs>